हाई एवरी वन दिस इज साक्षी एंड वेलकम बैक टू अवर चैनल मिडल वेयर टेकी इन टूडे सेशन विल टॉक अबाउट सोर्स टाइप्स इन कंटेंट मॉडिफायर सो इन प्रीवियस सेशन वी लुकड इन टू अदर सोर्स टाइप्स लाइक एक्सप्रेशन नंबर रेंज कॉन्स्टंट एक्सपात एक्सेट्रा एंड इन टूडे सेशन वील लुक इन टू वेरिएबल्स हेडर्स एंड प्रॉपर्टी so variables are used to store information with specific label allowing data to be easily accessed and manipulated within integration flows there are two types of variables present in sap cloud integration first one is global variable and second is local variable so the global variables are used to share data between independent integration flows in different integration flows global variables can be passed Global variables are accessible across multiple integration flows making it ideal for data that needs to be consistent and shared globally Consider a scenario where multiple integration flows need access to a common configuration or data like API key or a tenant ID In this case we can use global variables Let's talk about local variables So the local variables are used to share data between different steps of the same integration flow So remember the difference here in case of local variables we can share data between different steps of same integration flow but in case of global variables we can share data between two different integration flows local variables are accessible only within the specific integration flow where they are defined ensuring encapsulation of data within that integration flow consider a use case when intermediate data needs to be passed between steps within an integration flow such as processed message payload or a transform value then we can use local variables now let's move forward and look what header and property is so header is simply pass value from other header to newly created header we are seeing here headers and property from the source types of content modifier so the last one is property property is nothing but the source value depending on the type either header name a property name a variable name or any other type so today we have seen global variables local variables header and property let me go through variables again for global variables we can use write variable step to create a variable at certain point within the message processing sequence that to be used across integration flow To consume global variable we can set type as global variable and set it to header or property in content modifier and in case of local variable we can use write variable step type to create a variable at certain point within the message processing sequence and to consume the local variable we can set type as local variable and set it to header or property in content modifier So this is it for today's session If you like this video please subscribe to our channel and we'll see you in the next session Thank you.